La 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 Chicago. The hair of the tongue and the teeth and my lips Hava 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 Hello Beep Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel I'm your Tasker, this is my channel, welcome <laughs> Janice If you're new around here guys, welcome Hope you're having a good day Do you know what would make that day a little bit better? Nah, I don't get to say it Nah, go on then If you hit subscribe button, I don't know where you'll um Find it. What was that? It might make your day better, you know, and your following days throughout the rest of this year. And hopefully, further on more, I'll shut now. Beep! Well, we're here on another day. I'm very excited about this bad boy because I'm going to be showing you things that were part of my life. When when was when was I alive? 90s slash the. Are they called the noughties because there's two noughts? I always thought the noughties was an era in the world where people were being a little bit naughty. <laughs> It's just, it's just two zeros, isn't it, Joe? Joining me here today is my slightly pink top because I put it in the wash when it was white with red underwear. I, you, you don't care. I have my generic YouTube branded laptop and I am so excited. Right, listen. So basically, I had this idea when I kept putting in um, art attack clips in the clay video. I unloaded my brain the other day. What a mess that took a while to clean up. Basically, these are all the things I watched when I was younger. I started writing down just a few programs. I wrote 102 now, we're not going to go through all of them today. Do you know what? I'm just going to get on with it. I always do this, don't I? Who's this? Okay. Is that a spider? Oh, no, it's just string. You know, you get your Teletubbies. <laughs> you got your tweenies. Tweenie clock! Where will it clock? In between us is a totally different program. Do not get those mixed up. What are you doing? Brace yourself. As we enter my childhood. When I got home from school, one of the things that was first on the telly, Mona the Vampire. What a banger. I haven't got a massive idea of all your ages and everything, but I, I'm aware from my demographic statistics charts on YouTube, there's a lot more younger people watching now. Hello, Damien. Everything I watched, you may not have even heard of. Mona the Vampire is a... <laughs> it's about a girl with her friends at school, and she... she actually, I can't remember. She got into these, like, scary tales and stuff. But it turns out at the end of every episode, it was just her imagination, so nothing was real. Oh, spoilers. Two-hour compilation. Okay. He's a nice, naughty girl in an ordinary world. Show us your fangs. Grab your cat, grab your cape. The boogeyman, boogeyman, there's no escape. Now, if you're thinking, guys, Joe, what was that? There's plenty more of them to come. By the way, on this list I've got, there's many different genres, times of the years. Basically, it goes from Mona the Vampire to Bananas in Pajamas. Well, that's for another day. The next one that I've got is The Cramp Twins. The Cramp Twins. I don't know if the surname was Cramp or they woke up getting... Have you ever woke up and got a cramp in your leg? It's the worst thing ever. It feels like I'm waking up and I've woke up in death. This one is a beast. Oh, this is how they were born. This is how they're born. So they're in the... That's what a... Stomach looks like. Is that, the, is that, is that where they are? Yeah. What's the placenta? They don't... It's not just full episodes set in someone's womb. Womb! That's it! Womb! They're not in a womb. This is just the intro. This is really weird. I've just realised how weird this is. Bet you anything that he likes it. That's very weird, isn't it? One of them's blue and one of them's not blue. And they're just twins, but they look nothing. Oh my God, they look nothing alike, I've just realized. They're not twins. Oh no, twins, they have to be identical twins. No offense, Nicky and Sammy. But moving on, another one I used to watch was called Come Outside. It's about, go it's about going outside with um, a woman and a dog and they have a spotty plane. They fly in their plane. One time they went to the toothpaste factory. It was really good childhood, guys. That's the dog, that's the dog. Look up, look down, look all around. The dog just looked up, down and then all around. Up in the air. Or on the ground, on the ground. Some Somewhere walk, 
come for a talk right there's so much to see so come outside we are made of cardboard they do everything toothpaste apples bread gta 5 star i know that's something else i want to see him take off in the plane We're made of wood, we're made of plastic, or tin, we're sometimes big. Right, at school I had a problem listening and like, I know it's hard to believe, my attention span, it wasn't quite there. This, it's got a dog in it, I'll listen to anything that's got a dog in it. And useful for putting things in. What are we? Uh, metal! We're boxes. Okay. It's amazing. She teaches you everything. There's one called bread. An episode all about bread. 50 minutes of bread. Like food, dog, plane. Oh, I'm in heaven. The dog's died. I'll move on to the next one. The next one, I've got to get in there. I've got to get out of the way. Chuckle vision. This was, I, I put, I'm putting this in my top three. This was an absolute beast. It's about two Normans from Rotherham, and they just go around trying to do tasks in life. Kind of reminds me of two other people. No, why are we doing it here? No, 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 Lee, can you do this? No! You don't know what another one is. I don't know how to do this. I don't know who. Well, it's obvious, isn't it? We set off today, that means we've got Let's just fast forward a bit. This is like me and Lee walking down the street having a conversation. Excuse me? Why, what have you done? I see that when someone goes, excuse me, I go, have you farted? We've always time to help a lady in distress. What's so special about a dress? I don't know where you came <laughs> from, it just appears. Spoiler alert, I'm going to skip to what happens. <laughs> I'm going to skip to what happens, I definitely meant to say that. Uh, okay, no. Thank you very much. It's just so random, I love it. I'm going to watch an episode of that tonight. Look out! Now, with Art Attack, it was a guy that come out and he'd just make anything out of things you can easily have, like egg cartons, paper, pencils, sellotape. Who's this? Art Attack Disney? That's not- You just joined me in time. I'm finishing this very special delicacy. Right then. Are you one of those people who spends all day dreaming about your, um, <clears throat> Valentine? You know what you need? A heartthrob. And here it is. Watch this. There she is. Who's that? Say nothing. You need some thin card. You just got straight into it. I didn't know if I wanted to make that or not yet. Tell you what you need. A heart throb. Here's a picture of a woman in a heart. Hello? It's weird when you see someone else take over what you used to watch when you were younger. Does that make sense? Like Fireman Sam. Who is that? That's not Fireman Sam. He's on a quad bike. He's got a helicopter. That's not Fireman Sam. Where's the original Fireman Sam? Fireman Sam has 470,000 subscribers. Maybe he wants to do a collab. The thing about these are, they're such bangers. Fireman, and that was, that was, that's, that's a kid, um, called, um, um oh, what's he called? His mum always shouted him in. Uh, Norman Price! It doesn't end, it keeps going. Don't know why the van was rocking then. It's a sunny day today in Ponty Pandy. Where? A sunny day today in Ponty Panty. It's a Ponty Panty? Was he shit himself? Hello, you two. Everyone in this program was Welsh. I don't remember that. Then that's why it's called Ponty Panty. Very wish you were a serial say go go go. Oh, there you are. It's weird because over there in Ponty Panty land, no one's mouths moved when they talk. I can talk, but nobody knows who's talking. <laughs> Post from Pat intro, 1981. I wasn't around in 1981. Postman Pat, Postman there he is! Pat Look at the size of his nose! Pat! Jess! Hello! One absolute legend, Pat. One absolute nose. This is a cartoon called... <laughs> hey Arnold. Just, just watch this intro. What is wrong with his hair? 
head. He's got an American football head with a hat in the middle and his hair at the side, like a weird hat banana split. And to be honest, I never knew what was going on at this bit. He was just exploring and everyone's shouting his name. That's Hey Arnold, about a football head boy and a girl who does not like him, apparently. Every day. This is the one, oh, the, the tune for this man. Just sit back and enjoy this song. You've got to listen to your heart, listen to your feet, listen to the rhythm, the rhythm of your feet, of the street. Everybody! Hey! What an absolute cartoon. Right! We've gone through quite a few. There's a lot left, so... Another series is in the mix. But this last one we will end on is called The Wild Thornberries. All I remember is it had this girl in it with braided hair and the dad in it was called Nigel Thornberry. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I think they just went on adventures all the time. This is me, Eliza Thornberry. Eliza Thornberry, that's your name, Eliza Thornberry. Part of your average family. I gotta I like that. No, there's Nigel, there's Nigel. Wait for his voice. You see, my dad hosts his- Nigel! Basically, a mini Dr. Doolittle. Guys, bear with, because we're going to hear Nigel's voice. Just wait for his voice. But it goes on forever. Do, do not worry, we're gonna, we are going to find his voice. Do not worry. Nigel Thornberry montage. Hello, Hoggy. Hello, Hoggy. I found it, I found it. This is one of my favourite. This is what it was like in every episode. Apparently, this is what I'll be like when I'm a dad. Daddy. Uh, Janice, sorry. I'll do this with my hands. <laughs> <laughs> what a legend. Well then, I hope you enjoyed that. That was just, that was just, honestly, I'm not lying when I say this, right? This was like, that was like the, like the tiny little insight of a few programs that I used to watch. They get so much better. I don't want to mention any, but, but if anyone remembers Takeshi's Castle. But everyone, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a small thumbs up. Subscribe to make sure you don't miss any of the videos because they're coming out a lot more now. And I will see you next time. See ya. Ponty Panty. You what? Uh, okay. Oh.